if I show you this target without telling you which one shoots which, right? This is 25 yards, okay, 25 yards on a shooting rest. So this three target the same. This group, this group here, this group here, okay? So this three compared to this one, okay? 25 yards with a shooting rest. And the candidate is a USC edge case uh, popular 45 ACP carbine with uh, police and law enforcement for the urban mission. And this one, all, all, of course, is my beloved USP Elite 45 ACP. Okay? Look at again. This and this. Let's pick up the best out of these three, all right? This compared to this. And the answer may surprise you. It surprised me, you know. This is actually USC, all right? USC. This is USP Elite 45. Look at how concentrated it is. Cover it at 25. I just have to cover it. This is with green dot from Queen Sum Trace. An inexpensive option. Not cheap, but inexpensive option. And uh, when I was sighting it in, I shoot it high, so I have to put the red green dots right here. So I got some good group. Here, supposed to be here, but there's no reference point here, so it's more spread out, but this, this is good, good group, right? Good group. But compared to this, the result is the iron sight of USP Elite 45 ACP out shoot green dot carbine USC. What a surprising result. Amazing feat. You can put it on safe or double action. By the way, I uh, shoot it with single action. Pistol is safe. Very nice trigger, very nice trigger. And I just relax, you know, cover the target at 25 yards. Here you go. Amazing target sight. Accurate pistol, but more importantly, as I say many times, easy pistol to be accurate, easy shooting to be accurate. Unlike a 1911 custom gun, right? It's like driving a Ferrari, take some skills. This is so easy to be accurate with it. I mean, with that result, justify how to justify such a bigger real estate for USC, right? 
other than magazine capacity for the unrestricted version for the police force. I mean, this is a nice carbine. Look at how thin it is. It's very thin. The Netflix, there's a new movie come uh, in Netflix right now called uh, One More Shot or Last Shot, I forgot. But anyway, it's a siege at airport to disarm a nuclear weapon and USC is heavily featured in that movie so if you want to see this in action go watch that movie in Netflix it's a decent movie okay decent movie I set it up the green dots uh, coincided with the uh, iron sight so it's pretty neat. Yeah, pretty neat. But as I say in earlier, you know, for the uh, 25 yards, I have to uh, shoot it at six o'clock, probably even deeper, lower than six o'clock. Yeah, two options uh, with iron sight. The iron sight is pretty good. Okay, I use green dot just because for quicker, easier target acquisition. Let's put the magazine in here. to a HK slab. Sorry, got to uh, put the magazine out. To do a properly slab. It's all plasticky, you know, everything is plastic. So, for the one you don't like plastic, this carbide may not be for you. Safety is MB though. Trigger is okay, you know. Definitely uh, not a very easy trigger to pull. Hit the wall quickly, but big resistance. Big resistance. Maybe five pounds, I think. Definitely more. If there's one thing I want to criticize, it's the trigger, all right, for this carbine. I mean, magazine capacity is uh, okay because uh, C4 for civilian use, it's restricted anyway. So let's not take that into consideration, but the uh, trigger definitely uh, hard. Is it harder than double action? Hit the wall quickly. I think this one, double action is harder. It's harder. Okay, there you go. Very surprising uh, result. Uh, makes a great pair though, right? If you can have balls, have balls, you know. Uh, if you really uh, can have one, maybe just go with this to help and back. Go to the war pistol. Light, accurate, reliable. Definitely a very nice little weapon.